gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, we got a celebration that's going to happen, y'all. Y'all know what I'm saying? Woohoo! All right. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, and we got to celebrate some good times. I told y'all they should never have allowed somebody like me to have access to the ability to put something like this together for y'all. This is for our people. And we're also going to eventually help you guys. Ladies and gentlemen, you remember that Credit River decision where the bank manager got on the record and testified as to what the process was for making money by banks in this country? Well, ladies, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, he dead now, ain't he? But you know what? That mother was allowed to be cross-examined. Okay, now let's happen. Let 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 let's let y'all see what happens. We're gonna separate this right here. We gonna celebrate and have a good time. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Federal Rules of Evidence. I'm gonna have to remove it from the second one because he just repeated the same things, and I'm okay with that. Federal Rules of Evidence. The rule allows for the admission of testimony of a witness who is unavailable to testify in a current case if the witness was subject to cross examination in a previous proceeding and the testimony concerned the same issues and the same subject matter as in the current case. So if you get a certified copy of that record and a certified copy of that testimony, ta da! Because they're deceased. They testified under oath and there was cross examination. The judge even asked questions of the witness, and he admitted. You know what I'm saying? That's how we take care of the morons. Because I know y'all getting tired of repeating the same old stupid stuff over and over again. Now, I think Crawford, Washington, and Salerno, 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 Crawford, where Crawford at? There go Crawford, Washington, right there. I got to get rid of that one from the second one. See, we because he repeats the same stuff, so I have to go through and do this. This is for our people, okay? We're getting ready to send this to our people so that they can go ahead and take care of the small claims action. Ladies and gentlemen, this video is being done to let all of you know who've ever tried to use the Credit River case and they said that that was frivolous. Well, don't use the Credit River case. What is wrong with y'all? Use the testimony that was sworn under oath. What God is my witness, the whole truth and nothing but the truth, okay? That becomes evidence, ladies and gentlemen. It has never been refuted. Nobody has ever rebutted that testimony. The testimony was done under oath. There was no pressure on him when he testified. He testified freely on behalf of the Federal Reserve. Okay? Use that information against them. Do not <clears throat> with me, mother <clears throat> persons. Sorry, there are a bunch of individuals who try to claim, I don't know what I'm doing, don't know what I'm talking about. Well, how could I tell you that you can go back and pull testimony the same way they pull testimony from dead people and put them and use them against people all the time? You can do the exact same thing. But in this case, you use the testimony of Mr. Morgan, the bank manager. Use his testimony. Get a certified copy of his testimony. Introduce that into the record of your case. Guess what they cannot do? Oh, that's in it. That's inadmissible. No, you can't. Sorry. Nope. Deals with the exact same matter says going on here. I'm bringing the exact same argument. That's right. And I'm allowed to do that because we're talking about the law. And that case dealt with the law. There you go. And yes, he was an expert witness because he had been doing the job for more than 20 years. So that means he knew what he was talking about. Celebrate good times, come on! All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm tired. Been up for a while today. I'm gonna go, uh, you know, I'm gonna play Miss Led. That's gonna be the song. I, I haven't heard Miss Led in a while. Y'all know Miss Led by Cool in the Gang? Yeah, I know y'all know Miss Led. Oh. You know why? Y'all can't hear Miss Led? Y'all hear what I'm saying? I'm sorry y'all can't hear Miss Led. Miss Led, I apologize for that. But we, we, we ain't got no speakers on right now just to speak into the, the headset. So y'all just going to have to deal with that because I'm about to listen to myself some Miss Led. Uh, there was not enough sunshine today, so I got to go turn in the generator. So y'all have to excuse me. So got to go. Take care of yourselves.
I'm out of here. Misled. Gotta go.